Hello folks, how are you? Another episode and another tip sharing, you may want to call it, because uh, this one is not like uh, top 10 travel tips or top 60, top 40, whatever, uh, because there are tons of them available on YouTube. The one thing I'm going to share, which has some technical part of it, is that because whenever we travel, the most important thing we want to have is our cell phone because we have uh, usually our your uh, boarding pass a uh, copy of maybe a passport and everything so it's, it's digitally there so imagine uh, I always tell people or even uh, do as a practice myself have a printed copy but again that's the one when you need it or you're out of your battery and all that stuff but again uh, is one of the things that you want to make sure your cell phone is always charging. Maybe on the airport you may not be able to find an outlet. If you have an outlet, you may have forgotten the, the adapter. Maybe you're traveling from US to Europe, the adapter that goes in the socket is a different one. So any things happen, anything can happen, right? So in those situations, what you want to do is uh, buy the battery pack, right? Exactly. You'll go on Amazon, buy the battery pack. Hey, you know, I need a battery backup uh, and then I'll put it in a pocket and I'll charge my phone. And that exactly what I'm gonna share and what happened because I've tried a couple of battery packs and they takes hours. Of course, it will bring your phone up to some level of uh, uh, charge where you can turn it on, uh, maybe five, seven percent, and you can go through the boarding, but it's still, it's not something you wanted because you already spent the money and it's not meeting your requirements, not meeting your purpose. So I did try a few of them, I was not happy, I returned it, so to cut it short, what I did is that I bought a bigger one and then it all depends on the uh, ampere, the power of that uh, battery pocket. The one usually available, like uh, a small torch uh, kind of thing, it has only 5000 mAh milliampere. So, and that will take four or five hours to charge your cell phone. And for the tablet, even don't think about it. So in order to charge your phone within an hour, also, you need to buy up with more high power. And this is the one I bought it myself, as you can see. I'm using it, and it's more than a year. And it's uh, Anchor. The brand name is Anchor. Uh, so it's not, I'm doing marketing for them. Uh, I've been using it for more than a year, uh, and it is a game changer in a sense that it charges my not one phone, two phone, within an hour an hour and a half iphone 10 i am talking about and it takes only 90 minutes or less depending uh and it just uh, 100 percent in the iphone 10 battery is always uh, good like it works for a day and there were situations where i was running out of battery and because i was shooting and taking a lot of uh, videos so this product really helped me and this is 22,000 mah this is the product I have personally used, so I would recommend. And I bought it from Costco. Uh, but again, you can buy it online from Amazon. It's available. And I paid for this $125, I believe. But again, you know, it's worth it because the regular ones you can buy for $30, $35, but it's not worth it. But yeah, it's $125. It has two ports in it. And if you can charge two phone at the same time within an hour and a half hundred percent charge and uh, yeah but one only the only the drawback is the weight this is uh more than a pound i believe i don't know the exact specification but again you can put it in your backpack uh and you would not have any problem traveling it but uh, putting in your backpack for a whole day yeah that's kind of heavy but really i love this product i like it and that's why i'm recommending it and that's one of the very first video I'm putting just as a product review so you'll see more the product I've been using in the past uh, which was really helpful so I like it and that's I wanted to share I paid uh, $125 at the Costco you can buy online and yeah do check it out and let me know I mean what do you think about it so it's up to you again no product marketing it's just my uh, personal experience using this product thanks for watching bye and yes one more thing uh, if you're not traveling uh you want to keep using it once a while every one week i would say so let that cells 
uh, so there are the cells in the battery so you don't want them to die and sitting around and doing nothing right so that's these things work so every now and often charge your cell phone even at your home so make sure the cells gets dried 100 percent and then recharge it so this will keep it life longer thank you and bye